the, the land guard problem is not prevalent in the vested area and in the state areas. The land guard problem is prevalent in the non-state cluster. And the non-state clusters comprises of one, stool lands, family lands, clan lands, Tindana lands, primarily, depending upon which part of the country you are Which one is the Tindana in. lands? The Tindana lands are those lands in some parts of the Upper East, particularly region. Okay. So the areas around Bolga, the lands are not stool lands the way we know lands to be controlled by stools. So if you go to Bolga and you are looking for land to build, you don't go to the Bolga Naba. That environment within Bolga has four Tindanas. The Tindana simply means the descendants of the first settlers. Those who got to the land first, their descendants are the Tindanas. The, the Tindana is Guruni, it's a Frafra word, which comes out of Tinga, Dana. So the Tinga is the land and the Dana is the owner. Okay. So they are not, the Bolga Naba doesn't control the land. That area has four Tindanas controlling the land. There is a Tindana in one part called the Tindana of Soin. There is a Tindana in a place called Daporitindongo. There is a Tindana in a place called Tindomorigo. And there is a place called Tindonsobligo Tindana. So all these Tindanas are the custodians. <laughs> So, if you go to that area and you are looking for land, you don't go to talk to a chief. So, that's the Tindana areas. There are the clan areas. So, when you are on the Aplao Road, Pram Pram, Ningo, Ada, and its environs, the lands belong to clans. So, if you go to Ada and you want land, primarily there are about five clans, and the clans have their heads. You have to go and see the clan head, not the chief. Okay. So, for example, you could find Adibiawe, Akabiawe, Dangwebiawe, Tepebiawe, Lomobiawe. These are the owners of the lands, not the near Akuokun, the Adan chief. He doesn't have land. So, if I bought from the Adan chief, I'm buying from you the are, You have bought land from somebody who doesn't own the land. And there are parts of the country where the lands belong to the stools. You know, so our stools are those customary entities that represented by a chief who is supposed or expected to be acting like the managing director. Mm -hmm. So in our constitution, references to a chief includes a skin. So if you go up north, the traditional authorities don't sit on stools. They sit on skins. So stool land means skin land. When you get to a stool land area, or a skin land area. So if you go to Dagon, it's a skin land area. If you go to the Mampurusi areas, skin land. Mm. So over there, you negotiate with the occupant of a skin, okay. not a Tindana. Mm. 